Hey, what is up, Dupe? Uh, it's Altic here. And today I'll be showing you uh, how to create a search bar in your HTML website. It's really easy. And so let's get started. Uh, as you can, as you probably already know, I created a website for my previous tutorials. And I'm gonna create it in here. So you always wanna start out, start out with creating a diff. Uh, because if you want to change the color or the f shape of it, the search bar, you can just um, change it CSS. So I'm going to create a div. Actually, I'm going to go this so you can actually see it. So div. Oops. Div. Class. Equals. Quote. Quotes. Search. And in CSS, you're just gonna go hashtag search, but I'm gonna show you that later on. Search, and then close, close it. I press tab, form, action, equals. Um, here you're gonna write down your uh, website URL, but and it's gonna work after you upload your site. And so for now, I don't have it uploaded, so I'm just gonna write a random URL. Uh, my site, actually, YouTube tutorial.com. And close the quotes. Yeah, like close the brackets. And then we're gonna create an input type in. Input type equals equals, and over here you're gonna write down text because uh, if you write down password, it's gonna be like dots. If you write down text, it's gonna be normal letters. So we want to see what you're writing, so we're gonna write down text name. I'm gonna say search. Uh, and then we're gonna have to create a placeholder and this is like you know there's always like watermark uh, in the search bars where it says like search here or stuff like that and this is exactly what the placeholder is placeholder I'm gonna write down search here dot 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 close the quotations and close the bracket press tab again and input type now this is really important because you want to submit it you just don't want to press like search and then like nothing will happen so you want to submit it submit value equals search now you're gonna close this like this uh, then we want to close the form because we created a form here so form like this and then we're just gonna close the div like I, I don't know I guess I've already done that but I'm just gonna do that and div so let's save it and see how it looks see we have search here I'm gonna write down YouTube Press search. Now, since you don't have it uploaded yet, it's gonna say just you know your site slash a search and whatever you search for. But when you upload it, um, it will work, and I'll show you how to upload it. I'll show you how to upload it in the next tutorial later on. So stay tuned for more, and I hope this was useful for you, and I helped you. If I did, support me by liking and subscribing, and bye, see you soon.